find a cute house and a good area with fence. That's the requirements. Um, and across the street from Ronnie's dad and stepmom is a house that was for rent. The people just like left. One night they just like literally took some of their stuff and left and didn't come back. Or I guess they've come back secretly like a couple times to get more of their stuff but I don't think they've been back recently they left everything else so an older lady owns the house she just wants to honestly like sell it and be gone or be done with it because she's older and she lives almost an hour away and so my husband and his dad are like uh getting on her good side like talking to her because there are other people that are interested in the house because in the same neighborhood, it, it's a good neighborhood. It's like Fixer Upper. It's one of the worst houses in one of the best neighborhoods because the elementary and high school are definitely in walking distance and then the middle school is really, it's just a short drive. Um, and it's a good area, but it's definitely the worst house. He sent me a few pictures today when they walked through it and it was really bad. It definitely could have potential, but he was like, I don't even want you walking in it because there's like rat feces and like disgusting stuff. And just from the photos, there's trash and the carpet looks horrible and there's just crap everywhere. Um, so it would definitely be like a lot of work and we're not going to have money to do that between living off of him and starting a business and me not having an income. But we're going to figure it out. So... We are hoping that we could rent it or that he could like, he and his dad could talk to her and try to work something out to where they could help with like fixing it up and then let us live there once it's like livable and rent it and then be able to buy it or not. I don't think, I don't know. I don't think we would be able to buy it yet because we're tied up since we did small business loans and stuff. We're gonna be tied up in that. Um, but I don't know, I don't know how that works. And if we fix it up, then I don't know. There's just like a lot to figure out. But the, the ceiling I do like because it is a higher ceiling, kind of like ours. Um, and it's like all wood on the top and it's, um, it's a high ceiling. And it has a fireplace. Uh, that's pretty much all the photos I got was like the living room. So I think I didn't see anything else. But it's three bed, two bath, which is what we have now. Which I was just saying we probably would want another bedroom. But I mean I think it definitely has. Sounds like it could have a lot of potential. And give us like a project. Especially Ronnie since I'm going to be really busy the first bit like getting the store going so it could be good to give like him and his dad like a project to work on together and then obviously I would help with the design and picking out stuff but the, the gross work I would leave <laughs> to them I wouldn't have time for that um but yeah so that's what's going on I'm just trying to kind of think of the